Hi everyone, welcome to my channel and today we are going to study about English grammar, direct and indirect speech and it is very important for exam point of view. And before starting, let me discuss this. So here, one boy told to a girl that I will call you tomorrow. So the same thing that girl conveyed to her friend that he said that he would call me the rest next day. So here the bo the thing that the boy told here to the girl is a direct speech. It is the exact words told by the boy to the girl. But when the girl is wanted to convey the same to her friend or anybody else, she conveyed the exact word of boys but indirectly in her words so it is called indirect speech now let's study it thoroughly so here let's study first about direct speech so the actual words that a person said is called direct speech let's take an example Sita said I am eating. So here it is the actual, exact, real words told by a person means Sita. Sita. So if we want to convey the same thing to some somebody, so here we will use indirect speech means reporting what somebody has said to us, not using the actual words but the exact thing but not at actual words in our language that is known as indirect speech example she said that she was eating okay it is exact thing that sita told but in our language we told it we convey it to somebody we wanted to suppose your teacher told to you that please inform the class that tomorrow they are having test so you convey the same word told by your teacher to all your friends that tomorrow is a test. Okay. Teacher said that tomorrow is a test. So that is direct and indirect speech used in our daily life also. Now let's study about some changes that happen after a sentence is converted to indirect speech. Okay, that we should take care of. So the first thing is that when a direct speech convert to indirect speech, the punctuation marks are changed. And we know what are the punctuation marks, full stop, question mark okay these all things and the comma and the inverted commas are removed you noticed one thing that in direct speech every direct speech we see comma and inverted commas but when they are converted to the indirect speech these all commas and inverted commas are removed so that's why here it is mentioned that the punctuation marks are changed Second thing that in some cases the reporting verb is changed after the sentences sentence is converted to indirect speech. Example said becomes told and uh, sometimes it becomes asked, sometimes said becomes exclaimed according to the situation and the sentence and the rules we will learn. Next thing is that there is a change in personal, possessive and demonstrative pronoun. Okay, that we will see in next slide. Next is that there is a change of place, direction and time adverbs. Just now we will see everything that will be a crystal clear to us. And also when a direct speech is converted to indirect speech, question, exclamatory statements or imperative statements in the direct speech becomes assertive statements in the indirect speech. Everything we will learn with examples in the next slide. Don't worry for that. And last thing is that we generally use the conjunction that to introduce the reported speech and it is compulsory. 
all do the conjunction changes with the different kind of sentence that we will just look now everything and now we will see how tense change after the sentence is converted means uh, change to direct to indirect now we will look so here when the direct speech is on simple present when it will convert to indirect the simple present will change to simple past example boy said we play match every sunday so it is a sentence in simple present whenever we will convert it to indirect the simple present will convert to simple past boy said that they played match every sunday now next similarly present continuous will convert to past continuous varun said my sister is studying so it will be varun said that his sister was studying next present perfect will change to past perfect in indirect pu said manu has passed the examination so it will be pu said that manu had passed the ex examination and you can just take a screenshot of this one if you want next present perfect continuous will change to past perfect continuous mina said i have been dancing it will convert to mina said that she had been dancing if you are crystal clear in tense theory of the english grammar then you can understand it easily and it is very easy just you have to look is all about tense and in example you can understand it more frequently now next uh where we are yes so now simple past will change to past perfect in indirect speech suppose rahul said that uh, say means uh, rahul said i paid the electricity bill so when we will convert convert it to indirect it will be rahul said that he had paid the electricity bill next past continuous will convert to past perfect continuous in indirect suppose example mira said i was studying in the morning so it will be Mira said that she had been studying in the morning. Next, past perfect will con. Here the past perfect will not convert. Here there is no change of tense when the sentence is in past perfect. No need to change. Just we have to change this pronoun only. Here suppose a Kansa said I had painted the wall in the morning. Here it will be same. Everything will be same, but. except a pronoun it will be a kansa said that she had painted the wall in the morning everything is same but only a kansa one will be convert to she now past perfect continuous here it will also not change no change of tense only the thing that will be changed is the pronoun only here reserve said i had been washing the clothes so here it will be reserve said that he had been washing the clothes here everything is same but what we changed did that the pronoun i had will change to he had one more thing is there simple future it will change to here will will change to old sell will change to sold or old suppose karina said we will complete the work on time here karina said that they would com complete the work on the time okay if there will be a sell then it will change to sold or ruled that it little thing that we have to only concern about the simple future this much only the next thing is that models here we will also take care of the models following changes are made in models also here may will change to might can will change to could must will change to had to ought to will change 
nothing it will remain as it is used to will also remain as it is no change old sold cold might had to out to and used to do not change okay here we have to also take care of modals whenever we will convert direct to indirect you can also take a screenshot now next rules there are also some rules of changing of pronouns in indirect speech how the pronouns will change when the direct will convert to indirect or reported speech here we can also tell indirect speech as reported speech don't get confused because we are reporting now so we can also tell the order name of indirect speech is reported speech okay so now when the pronoun i is there in direct speech in reported or indirect it will convert to he or she okay example he said i like music okay in in indirect it will be he said that he likes music okay and here we can also point out whether the i will be he or she in the reported or the reported speech because here it is already considered that he said if there will be she said then the i will convert to her okay now next when there is we in the direct speech it will convert to they in indirect or reported speech example milk milk and term we play football so milk and term told me that they played football okay here that is in bracket because in this case that is optional okay because uh, in every case that is sometime omitted sometime is very necessary now next when there is you in the direct speech it will convert to i see he we they example john can you see me it will be john asked me if i could see him okay and here they will remain same it will not change suppose she said they have invited us so it will be she said that they had invited them okay they will remain same as it is she will also remain as it is he will also remain as it is it will also remain as it is and you can observe the examples and you can also just take a screenshot of it and here you can also see how place and time change in direct and in indirect speech and we will also see so many examples regarding this whenever we are changing what we all had discussed in next slide and here it is a side on given about tense that we already discussed and you just have to take a screenshot and learn it here you can observe some examples what i had given you in yesterday's previous slide he said i saw the film yesterday here see in previous we had noticed yesterday will change to previous day what we all had changed that he said that he had been the film seen the film the previous day here we changed to as per tense rule and also yesterday that place and time we change to previous day like this we will solve all the things that will be given to us in exam here you see abdul said i am going to meet a friend it will convert to abdul said that he was going to meet a friend like this i said i have i said i haven't to mumbai so here it will change to i said that i had been to mumbai see what all tense rules we had learned here it is applied okay and here the question i will so you of practice you just have to take a screenshot and learn it and uh, observe it and write it in a copy